Hey there everyone, welcome back to Cam's Arcade. Tonight I wanted to talk to you about four player gaming and how to accomplish that when you don't have a four player cabinet. If you recall, there are a number of old classics like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, The Simpsons, X-Men, Gauntlet, all games that were in the arcades that had four players all surrounding a screen, working together, playing together, having a blast. Well, you can accomplish that without actually having a four player cabinet like I did here. Um, this is Gauntlet. It's running on my At Games Legends Ultimate, which is normally just a two-player setup, but it's a four-player game. You can have up to four players playing. Well, how did I accomplish this? Well, I took the video from the At Games Legends and fed it over to the screen here to the right, and then connected a Legends Gamer control pad to the cabinet over here. So it sees two extra controllers, um, and now you can have four people playing together on the same game um, on the two screens so you don't have to kind of have four people surrounding this little screen you kind of spread it out a little bit um, this is really a great solution they came out with the Legends Gamer to uh, appeal to people that maybe don't have the space or want to have an arcade cabinet in their house but be able to play games uh, it's basically an At Games Legends Ultimate Cabinet, all set up here in this controller. And then there's like a little uh, hockey puck device that connects to your TV and you can play those kind of games. But what I think is just a really great feature is the ability to connect the two together and have four players playing together. Um, so that's a really fun way to play Gauntlet and those other games I mentioned and quite a number of other games side by side. And then I did something very similar with a couple other machines here. Um, this is a, a Rec Room Masters cabinet that I have with a tank stick, two player tank stick. And uh, this thing is very versatile. I have it connected to PlayStation 3. I have a PC in there. I can connect it to Xbox or a PlayStation 4. Um, and so what I have here running on the screen is a game called Overcooked. Overcooked is a four-player cooperative game where you have four chefs working together to uh, basically run a kitchen, making food and serving it to guests and, um, you know, just managing the kitchen and you have to work together um, because there's different stations and it's just chaotic fun uh, to play with three other friends. Um, you end up you know, laughing uh, a lot and uh, yelling a lot and you know you're up against the timer and things just are getting really crazy well normally here I just have two players right uh, if I want to play four players here's what I do I basically connect it to the Xbox over here that is running off this screen and it's basically a pedestal with two sticks that I have connected to an Xbox and, um, you know, they stand here behind the um, driving cockpit. So, you know, someone's sitting here in the arcade and racing here. You can be standing behind the cockpit, looking up and playing Xbox or PlayStation, whatever. I have both. Um, but I connected this to this. And um, again, sharing the same screen, um, playing the game and uh, it's really a great way to play four players and so I did that there as well as uh, with the at games um, setup that I showed you just a minute ago so that's how I do four players I don't have a four player cabinet but uh, you can accomplish it very creatively like I did so hopefully that inspires you and I'd love to know a little bit about how you do four player gaming in your arcade happy gaming everyone